When it comes to retouching, for me as a photographer, it's always been something that I've been pretty intimidated by. I do know how to do some basic retouching and just making sure like my clients don't just look crazy out here. But I'm talking about like fine detailed skin retouching. That's something that has been just difficult for me. But as a portrait photographer, of course, I need to know something when it comes to cleaning up my images and working on the face. And just like AI has been reaching so many parts of our lives every single day, it has reached photo retouching. Avoto hit me up to play around with this product and see how I like it. I've seen different photo retouching apps out there and seeing that it's becoming a thing and that's really exciting. I personally didn't think that I needed it, but of course I'm curious on trying it out. So I just wanted to do a pretty raw example of what this program can do. So you download it as a application to your computer. This is already graded, everything is fine except the face. So let's go back to the face tab here and let's go to skin retouching. Boom, boom, boom. And uh, let's do smooth face and skin again. And I'm gonna crank that up. Wow. Dude, face skin smoothing. That's crisp and that's scary accurate. A little too much, I say, but just. That's really good. She has like these two bumps here. How can I like get rid of that? Freckle and acne, let me bring that up. Wow, gone. <sighs> I'm like really excited to see it working this well, but like already, like I think, I think, I think I'm feeling this way because I'm seeing I'm just thinking about how much time this could have saved me. With this program, you can batch edit, retouch photos. And this is annoying using like old photos of mine because they could have been so much better. All right, let's try this image here of Erin and she needs some attention on her cheeks. Let me work on the blemishes first, actually. So if I go to freckle and acne, I'm gonna crank that up and it's gone. <laughs> this is cool. Look at that. <laughs> you know, it's funny seeing like the ads for programs like these and it has like a slider and it's like people with like this crazy acne and it just like vanishes like, yeah, that's legit. Like you can actually do that. And I haven't even touched all these other options here. And when it comes to retouching, if you have somebody that needs more attention on their face, you know while you're shooting, you're like, damn, like this is gonna take some time. And like I said before, one photo can take a while to retouch properly. And now you gotta do like a bunch, that's a lot. But being able to do this and batch edit a ton of photos saves you so much time. Photography is a wonderful thing. It's super fun. A lot of people love shooting, getting shots in the moment, but it's really editing that can really take the fun out of it. So being able to have something that makes our lives easier is gonna help us stay more creative. So and then I just hit export and then it makes a folder for you and then there's my image. It looks really good. Like to be very transparent with you guys, this program is amazing. It's really good and I, again, still, I don't always need to batch edit a ton of photos all the time. I'm not really a headshot photographer, but if you are a headshot photographer, I don't see why you wouldn't be using AI to make your life fun and beautiful again. But again, there's a ton in this program. I just opened this thing up and played around with it briefly. This program can do a lot more than what I showed you too. You can change the background of your image. You can brighten the eyes. They have a de wrinkle clothing, which is pretty wild. You can remove stray hair and even more. And what's really key is that you can save your presets and sync the settings across multiple photos. That's something I do in Lightroom all the time, but I've never been able to apply 
the same settings when it comes to actual retouching to multiple photos. And that's what really makes this thing lightning fast. New day, and I have been using the program a little more and thinking about it. Um, and I just want to give you my honest feelings on if I think that this is worth it or not. So with the pricing, they work on a credit system. So you buy a certain amount of credits and that gives you a certain amount of edits that you can use. One credit equals one photo. And with that, you can edit that single photo as many times as you want until you're done, which is nice. If I spent $84, I would get 1200 credits. For me personally, that's a ton. With the work that I do, I don't need to do a lot of high-end retouching. I don't need to do a lot of sky replacements. I don't need to do background removals. Sometimes I do, but pretty rarely. And that's why I say the lowest tier of 80, I mean, uh, 1200 credits is pretty worth it to me. But for the headshot photographers, the full-time headshot photographers and full-time commercial photographers that need to retouch a lot more in that style of photography, you're gonna use your credits a lot faster than someone like me. So I'm very curious if uh, you think that this program is worth it. Undeniably, this program does exactly what it advertises. It's incredibly smart and it's extremely fast and it's gonna save anyone who uses it a ton of time. And it's amazing to be in this era of photography where we have something like this. And if you know anything about dodging and burning and skin retouching and masking, it takes some time. So for me, it's interesting because I feel like I'm not the target audience, but I, at the same time, I feel like I am. One of the reason I don't think I'm the target audience is because I don't require a ton of retouching and features that this app can do. But because I don't, I'm not necessarily extremely skilled on knowing how to do that. And so it does kind of frustrate me when I have to, oh, let me change this background entirely or, oh, let me do some dodging and burning. And it kind of annoys me. So having something like this makes it so much easier and faster to, to me. So I'm going to eat it up when I need to. But at the end of the day, I wish you could just buy this thing once and live your life with it. I don't love subscriptions there's too many out here and yes this is not a subscription but i do have to pay more than once to use this program and i would just rather that i just bought it once and it did what i needed to do and it still had a dedicated team that were working on the app and fixing it and just making it better for all of its users and i'm sure a lot of you can relate to that so those are my honest feelings on this program very curious on yours and again just and just download it try it for free see how you feel and if you use my link you get 30 credits which is 30 photos for you to try out and those are my thoughts on a photo thanks for watching peace